Some women want to do DIY home pregnancy tests either because they can't afford a home pregnancy test from the store or they're into holistic medicine. There are a lot of different DIY tests out there. Um, I've heard about a toothpaste test, vinegar, sugar, bleach, the dandelion test, and really when it comes down to it, these are not very reliable. Um, you have a 50-50 chance of being pregnant when you do one of those, and the results are not conclusive. The first sign of pregnancy is actually a missed period. So if your period doesn't come, that's when you should think about pregnancy and go to the store and buy a home pregnancy test and take it. And actually, they can be very inexpensive. You, you can even go to the dollar store and get one for a dollar, and those are just as accurate as the more expensive ones. But the key is just taking it after your missed period because of how home pregnancy tests work. They work by detecting a hormone called human chorionic gonadotropin, or HCG, and that's a hormone your body starts to release early in pregnancy. And levels rise exponentially each day until about 11, eight to 11 weeks gestation when they peak. So you basically have to wait at least two weeks from the time of conception in order to get accurate results. You can get false negatives if you take a home pregnancy test too soon. Um, but let's say you, you took a test um, on the day of your missed period, it was negative. Um, I do suggest waiting five to seven days and then retesting if you still haven't had your period yet because again, false negatives are possible if the test is taken a little bit too early. Another important thing to keep in mind is read the test result within the amount of time specified by the manufacturer of the test. Most say to read it within three to five minutes. And so any result you see at that point is what it is. But a lot of girls are tempted to sit it on the toilet or they throw it in the trash and they go look at it later and they might see like a faint line and then they think that it means that they're pregnant, but that result is not reliable. Only the one that you see in the time frame specified by the manufacturer of the test. If you take a test and you have questions about the results, call your doctor and after asking you more questions about your observations and concerns, they'll decide if further testing is warranted. In some cases, a blood test is necessary and blood tests are much more sensitive than urine home pregnancy tests. And um, actually a blood test can detect pregnancy a week after conception, so it can detect it earlier and it's more accurate. And it can even actually give you an HCG level if they order a certain type of test. And this is necessary in some situations, but not all. So to sum it all up, the most accurate way to find out if you're pregnant is by doing a home pregnancy test, one that you can purchase from your local store or pharmacy. And if you have questions about that result, call your doctor and they'll order a blood test if necessary. But bleach tests, toothpaste tests, um, sugar, all of those other tests are not reliable. So you can't count on those results and to tell you if you're pregnant or not. If you have more questions for me in the future, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Intermountain Moms and recommend us to your friends and family too. 